guys. So I'm done with my trip today. Got the boat put away. Uh, yesterday when I was running my charter trip, uh, I blew a pin on my downrigger base. So we're going to head down to the charter boat and get that pin fixed. As you can see, it's just spinning. So what I need to do is I need to disassemble this and work on this. So I'm going to start getting into that and uh, we'll get this fixed. Okay, so there were uh, previous downriggers mounted here. I put some uh, UHMW here, and then I mounted my base plate to it. So it's kind of a pain in the butt, but it works. Uh, so now we're going to get this base off of this riser. This screws off. And as you can see, there's supposed to be a tip right here, and it's not there. So, uh, I've got the parts here. We're going to get this replaced. So, what we've got going on here is this handle will come off of here. Um, this nut spins freely. You may need to use a pair of channel locks to hold this piece here and then twist the handle off. And this nut slides off. This spring comes off. So I bought the replacement pin and I went ahead and got a new spring just in case it was the spring that failed. So the spring slides onto the shaft. The nut slides back on. The nut is what screws into the base plate. And then we're going to put our T-handle back on. And you can tighten it down partly by hand but you are going to need some channel locks or a pair of vice grips to tighten that all the way down. Okay, that's nice and snug. So you can see there's the movement that we're looking for. Okay, so one thing that you need to take a look at in here because it can cause you a problem later is the nub that broke off, it's a piece of metal like this. So it broke off of this one. So we need to look in here and find that piece. And I found it. It's right here. So there's that piece that broke off in there. So it's important to get that out. Otherwise, you're not going to be able to get the positive stop in the position that you want. So, got the base repaired. Uh, good thing is, I bought some extra pieces and parts, springs and pins if I need them in the future. Um, I will put these um, item numbers in the description down below in case you need to get your hands on these parts to fix your Cannon Downrigger swivel base. So until next time, thanks for watching.